Hello viewers, it is Jeffrey Gaming here. Welcome to the fourth race of my F1 2013 career mode. Great qualifying for the Sabres. Nico Hockenberg in 8th, myself in 10th. Um, I'm quite a bit off him, 6 tenths, but I only had one run in Q3, so it's not too bad. Vettel's on pole, and the championship leaders at the moment qualified 2nd and 4th. Um, I've turned the proximity arrows off and the driver's tags just to add a little bit of realism. We're on the grid in 10th, got the McLaren's around us and we are off in Bahrain. A pretty alright getaway. Russian didn't get such a good one but it's when I get into the 2nd and 3rd gear that I start to bog down some more. Under attack from Perez and Grosjean it looks like but I'm going to go through this gap. It's really tight here but I've made a few positions which is good. Hulkenberg's on my right, I'm going to try and evade him using the slipstream off the Red Bull to get past Hulkenberg and a bit of curse, so that's nicely done, but we're diving down the inside, oh, oh debris, that nearly hit me in the helmet, ugh, I'm just sick, I'm side by side with the Ferrari, could I get through here on the inside, I should do, I'm on the curve, whoa, whoa, the curve threw me at Massa, just like a woman throws himself at me. Well, I, I apologise for that lie, that doesn't happen, but yeah, the point is, I'm ahead in Massa, I wasn't driving dirty there, it was the curb's fault, but Massa's got a run on me here at the end of the first lap, I'm in sixth, is he, there he is, using the slipstream, no doubt a bit of curves as well, we're going to break evenly here, he was a little bit later, but I've got the inside line, so that corner's mine, a bit of oversteer there, my setup's given me a bit of oversteer during the race, but I think I prefer that to understeer as Weber and Massa are side by side. I've got a great view. I don't want to keep looking backwards too long or I'll miss the corner. But if them two are going to battle, I'll hopefully get away and hopefully close in on Rosberg. But as you can see from the end of lap 4, I've not really closed in on Rosberg. It's Weber that's closing in on me. Using DRS, he flies past me. And Massa looks like he's got a damaged wing as well. So that might hurt his speed. But Weber. Yeah, looks like he's got a lot more pace than me. And he's easily pulling away already. And I do aim to come into the pit on the next lap, so it's the end of this tyre cycle. So we'll be moving on to the prime tyres, which I'm quite looking forward to because I'm struggling a little bit at the moment. I haven't continued the tyre saving from China, because my tyres there were pretty good, but we're coming in to the pits to get the prime tyres oh another different camera angle I'm liking this and that's Alonso just ahead of me I know Button's behind me but why is Alonso so close that's what I'm wanting to know I'm really closing in as well I did go a little bit deep there but 11th place I'm sure Alonso was right near the front so I'm not sure what's happened to him He's had a bit of contact, oh he's got a problem. His car does sound strange there. I wonder if he's conserving fuel or something. But he was really slow and I closed in so much down here. As you can see, I'm using a little bit of curse but I'm easily closing in so he's definitely got a problem. It's an easy overtake on the Ferrari. The Sauber is overtaking the Ferrari. Awesome. Hopefully I'll be driving for Ferrari in a few seasons time. So I'll probably be teammates with Alonso, so not bad. But this car's in the pits as Button goes for the overtake on Alonso. And wow, I'm up to sixth place. That overtake on Alonso's boosted me up a position. But this is a fantastic race so far. Lap 8 of the race. It's Hamilton tests the fastest lap, but coming on to lap 13, Button's going for the overtake. I've kind of let him through, but I'm going to go for a diving move up the inside. You don't leave the door open like that, because if you do, I'm just going to go straight for it. As Button's battling with the Ferrari of Massa, I think that is. They're really close, and I'm going to be under major pressure for the last two laps. As Button's on the attack again, I let him go down the inside because I'm thinking go for a switch back here. I love the switchback, but I clip his tyre, which makes me go wider on the marbles. We lost a bit of time there. So unfortunately, I couldn't go for the switchback as Perez overtakes Massa behind. 
So the McLarens are really strong in this career, just like the Saubers. I really noticed that. I think we're battling McLaren this season because we seem to be getting consistent points just like them. And we're, we've had quite a few close races with them, just like here. But Bojan's not pulling away too much, and these tyres are lasting quite well. I could easily do probably five more laps on them. But we're preparing for the DRS zone. Hopefully I get DRS and I can go for the overtake, but I struggle to get the power down there. The traction wasn't great. Just look at Bojan pull away. Looks like I've missed my opportunity, which is a real shame. But 7th's pretty good so far. As Hamilton has won, someone has retired. I'm going to guess that's Alonso. But I pulled away from Massa and Perez, who must have been battling and struggling on their tyres. But it's been a good race. Very solid indeed after qualifying in 10th. Up to 7. Coming home for a fantastic 7th place. Just what the team need. We've scored at every race this season, the Sauber. Oh, and Hulkenberg got 1 point in 10. So he's been in the points every race. So the team's really consistent at the moment. It's great to see. As Hamilton wins, and he will probably extend the championship lead from Rosberg. And Vettel second, I'm down then seventh. A great race long battle with Massa and Button. Hulkenberg tenth. Oh, Alonso finished fourteenth in the end. Grosjean fifteenth. And Jeff didn't finish. So the Drivers' Championship. Oh, Alonso's got a bit of a lead going there. As the Mercedes are pulling away from the rest of the field. I have overtaken Nico. So I'm up to 7th. He's an 8th. It's going to be a close battle this season. And I look forward to it. And the McLarens are just behind us. So they're my rivals for this season. Mercedes have got a massive lead. Double Red Bulls points already. Sauber 5th place. Just behind Lotus. And just ahead of McLaren. So it's a great battle so far in the championships. And I hope you enjoyed the race. Spain will be the next one, and that's a good track for me. I hope to do some great things, and I hope to see you then. Goodbye.